Hey everybody, it's Riker Rider, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. When you get to a certain point in the game and you load your save file, you'll get a letter from Princess Peach with a number of 1-ups in it. Uh, it's been a while since I've recorded, since uh, family's been uh, really hectic. Like Lots of things have been going on. We had the carpet guys over, we had going away party... And we're finally starting to calm back down again. So it finally gives me a chance to record. I actually wanted to record the Haunty Halls segment on Halloween, but... That didn't happen. Gee, I wonder... When this is going to go up, because... Because um, at the time of recording, the videos that's going to go up next are... Number 20 and 21. Yeah, I record these well in advance. Because I know this game's gonna get hard. Oh, Luigi's here. I think I'm gonna use him. Yeah, I'm gonna use Luigi this time. Now, normally I don't like using Luigi, but I just feel like it this time. Supposedly, it unlocks some random ass feature if you use Luigi. I do like that they put the ghost house music. There's actually a lot of tunes from Super Mario World and Super Mario Galaxy 2. Hello. Oh, um. Whoa, hello. Another reason why I was kind of in the Luigi mood for this stage is because um, on Halloween, Sharky2107 did a stream of Luigi's Mansion, like getting all getting all gold frames, which I thought was a hell of an accomplishment. Although I would know because I've never played the game. It looks fun, and it definitely looks unique. I just, I just never got the chance to play it because I didn't have a GameCube. Like I didn't get the GameCube on its launch day. I only got it. <coughs> Excuse me. When did I get my GameCube? I can't remember. I want to say it was in O2 or O3. Yeah, it does. Go, thank you. Yeah, for some reason, those platforms just make me nervous. Oh, I got ten coins out of it. I believe is the most you can get out of those blocks. You might be able to get more, I don't know. But I don't care. It's not like I need them anyway. Is there even a benefit to using... Oh, shit. Is there even a benefit to using Luigi in this game? That was really risky. Come on, where's the way forward? There it is. Uh, there's the platform. <coughs> Excuse me. Don't know why I'm so groggy. Okay, well... Come on, go. There's our common metal. So, I've decided... Well, this is going to go up well after I make the announcement, but I think I am just going to have to uh, make, the, make an announcement every week before I stream, which is not what I wanted to do, because I thought my viewers had some semblance of... Uh, memory, but they don't. In any case, new power-up, the Bulb Berry. Um, it basically illuminates invisible paths. But it only lasts for a limited amount of time. When the path gets narrower, 
and the the uh, the clock ticks get faster. That's when it's expiring. Uh, the color of the <coughs> the color of the little flash is also a cue as to how much time you have on the bulb berry. And there are entire stages that are like this. I'm not looking forward to those one bit. Grab this first. They all do respawn after a while, so you don't have to worry about getting stranded. Just make sure you... Yeah, I'm gonna go back for that one. Hello. That one, no. Yeah, those guys are annoying, too. Come back for another one? Yeah, I do. I can hear the star. You know, this... The way they do these platforms... Like, how they, like, literally, like, appear and disappear in and out of existence. It reminds me of uh, Matter Splatter Galaxy from the original Super Mario Galaxy. In any case, that should be star number 44. <coughs> next time on Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2, we're going to get the next star in Haunty Hall's Galaxy. See you guys later.